Let's watch this one. This video is sponsored by Raid, Raid Shadow, Shadow Legends. Hmm. Mm. Business is important. Wow. Business the way. is professional. What? Business is the engine in the car on the road that drives us forward to okay. our journey. Sure. There is no I in business. There is. Welcome to the seminar. But there is. <laughs> Serious Business 101. Yo! Wait! First slide. Wait, 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 wait. Am I gonna be taught about business now? Yo, I need to write this down, write this shit down. I'm getting my pen and paper ready. Pen, pen, paper, pen, paper ready. Yo, we're learning how to make money now. Please. It's August 6th, 2013. Okay. And we're at a conference in Nashville, Tennessee. Okay. Agile 2013. Yeah. What's Agile? Well, it's blah, 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 blah. That bit's not terribly important. What matters is that this is a very professional environment. Keynotes. Panels, networking. You're fascinating to talk to. And a quirky little Whoa. idea. Interactive display boards. Five oh. of these placed across the convention grounds. In lobbies, Five. the cafeteria, gathering grounds. Yo, that looks sick, And there's though. a brilliant innovation to go with them. Yo, 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 it's Sherlock! It's Sherlock! Yippee! Thank you for the follow, hand drawn life. Yo! Dude, dude, dude. I love this show. I love this show. I love this show so much. I've rewatched it like three times now. Oh my god, I love this show. <laughs> Sorry, just ch simping. OT. I mean, my fucking cat is named after Sherlock, okay? My fucking cat is named after Sherlock. An automatic tweeting. <laughs> Simply use the hashtag Adra. <laughs> Can you blame me? It's better than Cumberbatch! 2013, and your unmoderated message will appear on the board. It even displays images. <laughs> wow! What an amazing idea, you guys. And people <gasps> were loving it. Giving feedback. Showing their pride. It was all going great. For a whole 87 minutes. That's when not one very attendee long. had a very unprofessional idea. He takes a photo yeah, of one of the displays and posts it to a certain message board with the following text. What did he write? Hello, B. I come okay. to you in a time of great need. Okay. Five giant screens. Ridiculous avatars, no. gore, and trap imagery would be much appreciated. No. Please. Pretty please. Well, we'd better test this out. So people logged into Twitter, wrote something dumb with the hashtag Agile2013, and hit send. No. A minute later, a new photo comes up on the message. <laughs> I actually followed you on YouTube just to discover you were live on Twitch, so I had to follow. Hi! Welcome in, welcome in. Glad you've been enjoying the YouTube. Message board. Confirmation. <gasps> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so there was everyone enjoying the conference. Potential when suddenly, <laughs> where in this convention do I find the Zimmerman themed butt plugs? My daddy never had big man talk with me. How do I make baby? I want baby. <laughs> And from there, it escalates. There's a guy having sex with a dead work. person in the Asia toilet. You can <laughs> find me. Is there only good for some making some tongue punching teamwork? My father should be accepted. Is there only good for making electronics? Now, it didn't take long for Agile organizers to notice. Agile <laughs> Alliance does not approve of the misuse of the hashtag. And here was the fatal mistake. They thought, It's only like three trolls from Twitter. It's no problem. So they rallied their troops, telling them to fight back with the report spam function. Yeah, right. Well, Good luck. Said B. If they want war, we'll give them war. <laughs> and honestly, they took it too far. No. They started posting increasingly reprehensible stuff on the timeline, to the point where all of the other attendees were drowned out by a deluge of horrific images. The report was slow and ineffective against people making alt accounts. So with each passing minute, they were losing more ground. A couple of agile attendees stuck their heads up over the trenches and drew targeted fire. Looks like the feed is being spammed pretty badly. Maybe time to switch hashtags. I can't be the only one reporting all these people. Why doesn't Twitter make them go away? Lisa is giving free toss jobs at the main screens. Flailing round of- I'm blocking and blocking, but they keep coming up. Eventually, someone from B offered some useful advice. Have you tried getting the cyber police involved? How do I contact these cyber police? But tragically, the cyber police never came. Yeah. Report them! Stop them! cried one of the organizers. 
but it was no use. And soon he was targeted too, with his profile and personal pictures shopped into compromising positions. Then those shops were, of course, posted back onto the Agile hashtag. Eventually, Agile had had enough, and they surrendered, disabling the Agile 2013 hashtag. Unlucky. And that was the end of it. Unlucky. Or was it? Oh no! Because it turns out there was another functioning hashtag. What? Agile 2. Huh? And once B figured that out, they took to destroying that as well. <laughs> and that really was the end of it. Or was there? Or was it? Because B found the host website. They went straight to the source, uploading content directly to the displays. And that really, really was the end. Oh, was the next it? day, the only thing no, on the okay. displays was this message. We are working on shutting down the Eventifier site. We are reporting abusive accounts. We are also trying to find all other sources and shut them down as well. No. I'm sorry. And that was the tragedy that befell the Gaylord Ops. Very unprofessional. <laughs> this is amazing. What the fuck? Cool, well, yeah, you're all doing also funky from YouTube as well. Really good stuff. Aww. I'm so happy you guys enjoy that stuff. Oh my god. You guys? Yeah? Slide two, please. But first. Oh. Airtime. Shadow Man here with Raid, Raid Shadow, Shadow Legends. <laughs> Available now on iOS and Android. It's a totally free RPG PV. Red Shadow Legends kind of died down, just didn't it? I don't hear, like, I don't see anyone ever being sponsored by Red Shadow Legends anymore. Yeah, I honestly think it's like all big anime waifu titties now. P DVD for people with ADHD, but don't take my word for it. Here's someone from IGN. <laughs> uh, we Look how many positive reviews it has. In fact, I bought another phone with my sponsorship money so I can dual wield raid. He did have two phones. Raid Shallow, Shallow Legends. Leaves. Do you guys not have phones? Yeah. Dozens <laughs> of upgradable characters. Fleshed out storyline. Wait, I just realized this is my one opportunity to say bad stuff about Shroud. I've watched almost every one of his videos. He'll never hear it because he always skips my fucking ass. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Red Shady Shadow Lemons. Legends. But don't take my word for it, here's someone from Qualcomm. Texting. Mom, I've been playing for two days straight, and there's nothing you can do to stop me. Hey, wait, no, no, stop. Mom, <laughs> look at this one. I use this champion because she has a massive co Are you playing a fucking console? Throw that in the trash, my dude. That's my dialysis machine. Your phone is the <laughs> only dialysis machine you need. Giant boss fights, <laughs> PvP battles, almost 10 million players. Are you playing yet? Get it with the code in the description and get 50k silver and a free epic champion. What a twist! There's also big plans to update the game. Here's a robot for the next She's six months. Boy. All right, Brain get the game. Shot. I've been Shadow Man. Thank you. Well, he makes the head entertaining. Right, where was I? <laughs> McDonald's. Is a business. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. Mm -hmm. In January of 2012, they had a brilliant idea. Let us improve brand perception with Twitter. Let us appeal to the common man with hashtag meet the farmers. Okay. A campaign that informs them that our meat only comes from local, independent producers. Mm -hmm. And not from, as the papers report, orphanages. No. So they published this promo. What? I don't think I've ever gone to work a day in my life. <laughs> And success. Hell yeah, lads. Another win as usual. People were loving it. <laughs> no, no, get that shit out of my they ears. They the usual detractors, of course, but overall, good stuff. Oh my so god. So they swapped have out this hashtag with a new one. I see that fucking movie. I forgot what it was called, but overall, man. That movie. Good stuff. The, oh my. Oh my god. I've, I've seen that fucking movie. I've, I've seen that movie. I, I can't. Here's my one. Shut the fuck up, Sam. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> so they swapped out this hashtag with a new one. Yeah, dynamite. Um, Napoleon dynamite, I think. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, Napoleon dynamite. Oh my god. That that. I. It's. 
I I have no words for that movie, man. It's so shit that it's good, but it's shit. You know? It's so shit, but it's good, but it's also so fucking shit at being shit to be good at shit. I I just The movie is a fucking fever dream, is what it is. The movie is a fucking fever dream, is what it is. McDee's stories. And here's where things took a turn. They wanted the Twitter public to tell their experience. So it's the room tier? I don't think I remember what the room was. And here's where things took a turn. They wanted the Twitter public to tell their experiences at McDonald's. <laughs> Obviously only good things ever happen at McDonald's. This is oh, hi, my- Oh, that's- Okay, okay, got it, got it, got it, of course, that's, 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 okay, got it. Oh, hi, Mark, yeah, okay, fair enough. <laughs> fair fucking enough. <laughs> I did not hit her, I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. <laughs> I, I love the acting so much. Slam dunk. Let us shake hands in confidence at our imminent success. So McDee's stories premiered on the Twitter homepage, and I always thought Ronald within McDonald's five minutes was it was creepy. clear that people weren't going to harp on about the time they got a free extra sauce with their McNuggets. Instead, they were going to tell McHorror stories. Here's just a select few: story. a McFingernail in my fries, what? a woman McSoliciting McSex in the. I guarantee you, all of these are just from America. All of these are just fucking America. Like, over here in Europe, McDonald's is fucking good. McDonald's is so fucking good over here. Sorry, we got health regulations. The drive through lane. <laughs> I looked this one up, by the way, it's true. My friend claims the roll- Wait, 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 go back, rewind that shit. A McFingernail in my fries. A woman McSoliciting McSick. Woman is accused of offering sexual favors in the drive through lane in exchange for McNuggets. <laughs> I mean, you gotta do for the nuggets what you gotta do. In the drive through lane. I looked this one up, by the way. Woman arrested for offering sexual favors in exchange for McNuggets. It is what it is. It is what it is. Wait, it's true. My friend claims that Ronald McDonald laggies. exposed himself to her as a child. Wait, That's what? Awful. McRats in the buns. Oh, yikes, this one's real, too. Go <laughs> back in the bun area. You're going to find at least three racks stop. that got droppers on them. Oh, God, make it stop. Someone stop it now. But it was gaining traction. More and more people were publishing their negative stories on the hashtag. Wow. And once they had used all those up, it progressed to just making up stuff for shock value. McD. Story. I ate McDonald's as a kid, and I'm pretty sure that's why my father left. Closed eyes, sad face. I once saw her. I can't say that. I can. I once saw a homeless man fucking the colostomy of another man with a cerebral palsy in a Mickey D's bathroom. Now that's something to clip and quote out of context. But that'll make anyone grimace. Thank you, thank you. Within two hours, they pulled down the advertising campaign and in its stead, put up a far more innocuous little things hashtag. <laughs> they had a few minor trolls there too, but it quickly faded into obscurity. The media jumped on the story, case studies were written, and lessons were learned about not giving the public an in. Or were they? No. July 1st, 2016. Create your own custom burger on this McDonald's website. Bun, meat patty, semen. Name your- Dude, 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 that just should remind me, like, this, this wasn't it, but as a kid, like, you were all on those stupid ass Flash website, right? Where they offered games, and there was this game where you operated an entire fucking McDonald's, like, um, not only the McDonald's, but also the farming and the production, and you had to kill the fucking cows in it. <laughs> oh my god, that was that was a good shit, man. That was a good shit. <laughs>
They made the mistake of trusting people on the internet to not do a ha ha funny. <laughs> so, Minecraft. <laughs> I remember the game. Yeah! Nice! Papa Pizzeria. No, it was actually McDonald's. It was actually McDonald's. You just reawoken the memory. Yeah, I just. The memory just. <laughs> Unlocked like seeing this shit. Like him talking about gay or uh, about flash games or like showing a flash game. Holy shit. Custom burger on this McDonald's website. That just literally Run, unlocked the patty. memory. See. Core memory fucking unlocked, man. Name your creation. Have it published on the website. Then vote on the best one and it will become an official item on the menu. Also, I don't you I don't care what anyone says. I fucking love McDonald's, okay? Like Stay away from the fucking Big Mac. The Big Mac is a fucking scam. Stay away from that one, but the Big Tasty is fucking delicious. The Big Tasty is so good. Don't, like, bro, the Big Tasty is so good. You knew where this was gonna go. I knew where- Also, obviously, french fries are the fucking best at McDonald's. French fries are the fucking best at Mackey's. And the chicken nuggets. Bro, chicken nuggets. Nuggies! Everyone out here always saying they hate fucking McDonald's and McDonald's is shit and yet again they will goon over fucking McDonald's nuggies. Like, shut the hell up, we all love McDonald's. Even if you don't admit it, you still love the nuggies. This was gonna go, how did McDonald's not? <clears throat> and also, and also, the Coke tastes better at Mackey's. The Coke tastes better at Mackey's. the menu you knew where this was gonna go i knew where this was gonna go how did mcdonald's not <clears throat> a poem if you okay we don't have arby's over here and jack in the box we don't have those over here so i can't comment on those you will the sprite had stiff in the spiders the, the spider sad spider. european yeah. a thin privilege to go but a bag of lettuce no Coke. tissues a mind comp <laughs> Just so. The atheist delight with a side of fry. Wait, wait, wait. We're starting over. We're starting. We're starting over. The sad European. A thin privilege to go. Bag of lettuce, no tissues. Mine comp. Just so. <laughs> the atheist delight with a side of fries. The toddler body bag with what? double ketchup surprise. <gasps> Pepe the sandwich. Pepe! A little prolapse half baked. What the? How in my behind daddy comes with a shake. Girth. Girth. <laughs> area. A vision of Christ. A whole pineapple with your meal for ten hey, times yo. the price. A tip for my lady. The this fedora. Is even free. The it's still not too late to vote for Bernie. <laughs> Whopper, no onions. Anatomical sandwich. Okay. Just, just grow up, you guys. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, <laughs> I have to shower off Ron's creamy surprise. See, this this is you, you fucking clown. <laughs> My bad. Mm, yeah. Naturally, the press seized on it as much as the general public did, laughing at all the dumb sandwiches while also condemning them. Guys, come on, guys. This isn't funny. Come on. Yes, it was. The website was shut down and not much <laughs> remains. Except for these. <laughs> and also this text document I found, which has a bunch of other sandwich names. Yes. What ingredients were involved and what they look like, though, you'll have to use your imagination. Next. Oh, my local McDonald's give uh, the cold or messy food, like the wrap inside the chicken wrap. What the fuck? That sucks. I'm sorry, man. Go to another McDonald's. <laughs> I also have never experienced the ice cream machine being down, by the way. Whenever I go to a McDonald's, I can get ice cream. I can get my McFlurry. No issues. Slide, please. Prophylactics are serious business. Let us shake hands in both a fun and safe oh, manner. Oh, I see this one is ribbed for my pleasure. Early 2013. That's more of a US thing? Uh, makes sense, then. Ice cream machine is always down only in the US. Okay, okay, that makes more sense if it's more of a US thing. <laughs> what the hell, man? As I said, McDonald's is just fucking better in Europe. <laughs> Jurex launches a revolutionary new app. Iso Are we still getting monetized? <laughs> US condoms. Download. Select the product. 
enter your location, and a okay. condom will be delivered to you within an hour. <laughs> oh, perfect timing. Their emphasis was on discretion and anonymity when delivering the goods, okay. and the delivery drivers were in disguise. Pizza delivery guy, police officer. Wait, sure. I remember those ads. Wait, wait, I've seen those ads. Hold on, I have seen those ads. It's over. Chill, chat, chill. What am I flexing? Chat, go up! Kids over here flexing her ice cream machine. Bro, I love my McFlurries. <laughs> bye bye monetization. <laughs> From Canada, I've only ever been to a McDonald's where the ice cream machine had was down. And I'm very surprised it never happened to me. It happened more. Hmm. It's an American thing. The company that supplies the machines has some monopoly on the repair service and charge a fortune so McDonald's just doesn't get it. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> That's so messed! I saw those ads like once or twice a year ago. Wow! I had wings at McDonald's in Europe. They were delicious. Dude, yes. Yes. European McDonald's is amazing. That's legal. Also, KFC in Europe is amazing. A gimmick to be sure. And some people thought it was an out of season April Fool's joke. But people tried it out <laughs> and it really worked. So they rolled the service that. out over the tip of Dubai, mm? of all places. But after its first week, the government shut it down, citing it as promoting promiscuity. Booted out, they had a tough time deciding where to launch next. One step, guys, guys, let's let the audience decide with another online poll. Oh, for fuck's sake. So people jumped on the website and started SOS voting. Condoms. I will be voting for a Krispy Kreme donut place. Tens of thousands of votes were counted, with some of the major contenders being Paris, Singapore, Kuala Lumpur and London from South Africa to move away from this. But all of them were outshined. With the most votes counted for... Batman. <laughs> Wait, what? A small conservative... I'm from Europe. Yes, McDonald's was so good to eat. Right? I love Mackey's. ...of Muslim city in Turkey. <laughs> Let that be... Thanks to the fire as well, guys. ...the dangers of tampering with the laws of Batman. mother... Batman. ...nature. Fucking the internet Batman. rejoiced. <laughs> Another marketing campaign to add to the KD ratio. <laughs> Facebook post went out from SOS Condoms congratulating Batman and to stay tuned for more to come. But there was no more to come, so to speak. The campaign was promptly stopped. SOS Condoms never opened in Batman. Not SOS really Condoms cheap. never opened anywhere ever again. Man! They went silent for months. Everyone moved on. SOS Condoms deleted their account and slipped forever away Such. into obscurity. What is that? Pizza is serious business. Sure. DiGiorno sure. does frozen pizza and they have a substantial social media presence. Domestic violence hmm. is bad. Bold sure. statements only on this channel. Well, Twitter had a hashtag for National Domestic Violence Awareness Day. People were sharing their harrowing stories with the hashtag why I stayed. Oh, oh shit. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, they messed this up, didn't they? I I see where this is going. I can see where this is going. <laughs> These were all quite serious. Oh no. And dealt with some delicate and sensitive issues. Oh no. Then here comes DiGiorno, throwing on the accelerator, no chance <laughs> given, driving right through the front door. Oh, they no. had pizza. <laughs> Ooh. Hee <laughs> hee, that was a great tweet. I bet everyone is loving it. Unlucky. Oh no, oh no. Bro, the stairs is so creepy. Make it stop, please make it stop, make it stop, please! Precisely 0 0.1 seconds after they posted it, they must have realized it wasn't the wisest move. Yeah. And they apologized, but the media got involved. So they kept Too late. apologizing. I'm sorry. They couldn't I'm sorry. stop I'm apologizing. Sorry. I'm sorry. They just. I promise you never again. Kept I'm so sorry. At it was terrible. They I couldn't be more sorry. But please accept my deepest Dude, apologies. Dude, relax. I am sorry. Naming your baby is serious <laughs> business. Put it to the internet, this Canadian couple said. Oh, no. Trust in the kindness and sensibility uh, of strangers. Uh, no. It was Cthulhu. I think I heard of that. <laughs> Next. No, okay, Do you I know didn't hear about that one. Is? No. It's important in print. It's essentially the proportional spacing between fonts. Oh, okay. Why does it matter? Well, sometimes two letters close to each other can look like a single letter. Oh. 
you get away. I'll get out of the way for you guys. I'll get out of the way. You guys like that? You guys like that? You guys like that ad? <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Alright, stop. Let me finish up with a little bit of a behind the meme style history lesson. Okay. In the early 2010s, brands oh. were only just finding their foothold in social media. Yeah, they yeah. didn't quite understand how to connect with their audience. The tendency was to be a bit overly formal, stuffy, not quite fun. That is until Denny's came along with a game-changing Tumblr account. Tumblr account of all things. Time, and it appealed to fellow Zoomers, such as myself. Denny with their wedding, it probably. Took a little while. But soon, other brands cottoned on to the strategy. Arby's started posting memes. Wendy's dropped a mixtape. Don't play for a mixtape. I was about to say Wendy's. Um, freaking uh, social media manager was on fire for a few months straight, man. Maybe even a few years. I don't know. Damn, don't follow that sense. anymore. And then went into a WWE-style feud back and forth with Burger King and McDonald's. <laughs> And Gen Zers, such as myself, lapped it up. How do you do, fellow kids? Now that's not to say they all figured it out. Other coffee brands fee? It too, not the coffee fee! Without committing fully, they failed to get the same appeal. So into the late I can't do this teams, anymore. Things were going pretty great. It was a little content renaissance. Chick-fil-A is officially America's favorite fast food restaurant. Imagine if we opened on Sundays. Had to give everyone else, like Wendy's, a chance to make money. Your mom is a hoe. <laughs> Steakums even broke out. <laughs> Speaking of Wendy's. On the whole phenomenon on Twitter and in articles. <laughs> and I'd like to turn that into a full video soon. But, with all these relatable memes floating around, people were starting to feel a little pandered to. <laughs> Very relatable. Yes. Nice, that's, that's relatable. Yes. Relatable. Hmm. Relatable. Okay. Oh, okay. It's getting so fucking relatable, it's actually kind of annoying. <laughs> Guys, we get it. You're relatable. Uh, okay. I just, it just stop relating. Stop. Stop. Enough. That's it. I can't take it anymore. Uh, silence, brand. And so a new meme was born. The spider crab with laser eyes, aerial font 32 point, white on black bar. Wait, I don't remember shirt. this. Yes. Silence, comma, brand. I and it was have a not very seen this. Tool. M &Ms pushing something or rather. Take that brand. <laughs> hey, wow, that's Gen amazing. Zers. Silence, brand. <laughs> and it became a long and enduring meme. Amazing. OMG, I feel that. That is such a mood. Relatable AF. Silence. Sometimes a few brands could crack oh. through it. Silence Twitter. Well, but Mao. for the most part, this crab has become the quality control of Twitter. The Mao. An apex predator shutting down lesser brands. <laughs> Not the God fucking apex bless. predator. Alright, it's time to stop. That's enough business for today. Thank no. you for attending my seminar. Here are the patrons. Thank you very much. I love <gasps> you. Mwah. See you at movie night. Oh, oh, oh. Also, uh, oh, oh. I have other videos on the second channel. Sonic cried a little, and Tails put his hand under his face to catch the tears. The chef should have dipped some on his finger and then insisted that the host. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> and also, Shadow Raid Legions on the Nintendo GameCube. It's actually really fun to play while you're watching telly and doing stuff. Use the link.